Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 most rewatched video game cutscenes. I'll have two number nines, a number nine large, a number six with extra dip. Did I ever tell you the definition of insanity? For this list, we'll be looking at scenes in video games that just make you want to hit that rewind button. From iconic moments, memorable goodbyes, to jaw-dropping spectacles. What cutscenes made you want to go back and experience again? Are there any we missed? Let us know in the comments. Number 10. Welcome to Rapture, Bioshock. I am Andrew Ryan, and I'm here to ask you a question. Is a man not entitled to the sweat of his brow? After surviving a plane crash in the middle of the sea, a strange lighthouse offers refuge, but it's only once you get plunged down into the depths of the ocean do you hear Andrew Ryan's vision of a new utopia. As the music swells and Ryan's speech comes to a climax, you peek beyond the film screen and bear witness to the pure majesty of Rapture. Rapture. With sprawling underwater skylines and enormous undersea creatures passing by, it's contrasted with the dark reality once you enter the city. The opening of Bioshock is a prime example of how to set the tone of a game, making it all the better to rewatch. Number 9, Eli's Fate, Half Life 2, Episode 2. I believe Gordon should have the honor. You'll hear no objection from me. It's all yours, Gordon. When you don't have much hope for future releases, it's hard not to go back and relive the glory days of Freeman's adventures. As Gordon and Alex make their way to the chopper after the successful launch of the rocket, a combined advisor breaks in and restrains them. Eli attempts to fight them off, but sadly meets an untimely demise. I love you, Dad. No! Oh my god, no! No! As the credits roll, Alex sobs for the loss of her father. The amount of buildup in this critically acclaimed series just to have it end like this was incredibly unsatisfying for a lot of people. This heartbreaking scene was the last moment that many fans have, so it's no surprise that they would want to see it again. <laughs> Number 8. The Definition of Insanity Far Cry 3 That is crazy. But the first time somebody told me that, I don't know, I thought they were bullshitting me, so boom, I shot him. While this may not be the same explanation you can find in the dictionary, it's way more memorable. Voss is a terrifying presence throughout Far Cry 3, and it's here when you really glimpse into his deranged psyche. Did I ever tell you the definition? of insanity. Having escaped him before, the lunatic educates Jason on what insanity is, with his own delicate sanity unraveling. This moment plays out so well, you can't help but go back and listen to it again and again. He eventually leaves the player to drown, only for you to survive and go back to trying to kill him. Voss should have taken some of his own advice. The thing is, <laughs> okay. he was right. Number seven. The Final Confrontation, Metal Gear Solid 4, Guns of the Patriots. Time for you to put aside the gun and live. The Metal Gear franchise is a long and hard journey for many of its characters, but this game was the chronological end of Big Boss and Solid Snake. As Big Boss explains how everything unfolded, we get a melancholic speech about how he, his allies, and his foes were all trapped in the same cycle. The last ember of this fruitless war dies out, and at last, those old evils will be gone. 
As the virus eats away at his body, Snake leads him to his grave and helps him light one last cigar before he passes. Seeing all the history dissolve in front of us, we are left with a strong and emotional conclusion that you'll want to keep reliving just so you can feel like it's not over. This is good, isn't it? Number six, Robot Opera, Portal 2. Are you still alive? You are joking. You have got to be kidding me. Well, I'm still in control, and I have no idea how to fix this place. Music has been a large part of this series' success, with the credit song of the original Portal giving us a joyful but unnerving conclusion, which they improved upon even further with the sequel's finale. During the final battle, your Portal to the Moon sends Wheatley spinning into space, crying for help. Change your plans! Hold on to me! Tighter! Ah! This leaves you with a grateful GLaDOS, who quickly goes back to being a heartless machine and leaves you cornered by turrets. Just when you think it's all over for Chell, you're gifted with a turret opera as you are slowly elevated to the surface. Seeing all these dangerous robots sing to you is a feeling like no other, which is why it's worth multiple viewings. Number 5. Big Smoke's drive through Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Can I take your order, please? Carl, what do you want? You gotta eat to keep your strength up, man. Grand Theft Auto is awash with many iconic characters, no matter what entry you play. But this one moment isn't just noteworthy, it's iconic. CJ and the gang decide to go and get something to eat, and after some deliberation, they decide to go to Cluck and Bell. Everyone gets a little something, but Big Smoke needs a big something something and goes all out with his order. I'll have two number nines, a number nine large, a number six with extra dip, a number seven, two number 45s, one with cheese, and a large soap. It's a funny scene no matter how many times you watch it, and puts us in the mood for even a slice of Spoke's Feast. Give me a number nine, just like he is. Number four, Ellie kisses Riley, the last of us left behind. Who am I to stop you? The one person that can. No, please don't go. I'll be so miserable without you. The Last of Us is a roller coaster from start to finish, featuring the growing relationship between Ellie and her pseudo father figure, Joel. But this wasn't the first time Ellie had someone she deeply cared about. In the DLC, we are privy to the last moments between Ellie and her best friend. But it's before that that we get to see Ellie sharing some tender moments and then dive head first into a kiss with her crush. The kiss surprised us all, and it's a wonderful snippet of happiness before our heroine's world drastically changes. So forgive us if we want to relive the good parts before everyone starts dying. What do we do now? We'll figure it out. Number three, Zeus kills Kratos, God of War 2. The gods are petty and pathetic, and your rule is weak. I grow tired of this insolence. I am the king of Olympus. The ghost of Sparta proved himself as the ultimate warrior, taking his place amongst the Greek gods. After taking down many foes, you feel almost invincible, but once he's tricked by Zeus into becoming a helpless mortal, he's savagely slain, supposedly for the last time. Even now, as you draw your last breath, you continue to defy me! Kratos never stays dead for long, though, constantly climbing out of the underworld. But what makes this moment so special upon re-watching is the knowledge that Kratos is in fact Zeus's son, transforming this scene into something so much more brutal. Be certain of that. Number two, Kingdom Hearts openings, Kingdom Hearts series.
With its magnificent scale and wonderful characters, the story of Kingdom Hearts is something to behold. And with a crossover as ambitious as this, this series needed to hit the ground running. That's exactly what they did with the cinematic music videos at the start of each of the games. Each opening leaves you wanting more, with its mysterious imagery to set up the main characters and foreshadow the events to come, accompanied by fantastic songs by Utada Hikaru. Since the first game in the series was released pre-YouTube, the only way you could go back and listen was to start the game again, but it was always worth it. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Tidus' Laugh, Final Fantasy X, the most infamous Final Fantasy cutscene. <laughs> War Never Changes, Fallout series, a true staple of the post-apocalyptic franchise. But war, war never changes. Space, Command and Conquer, Red Alert 3. Tim Curry's fantastic acting makes this scene very memorable. Space! Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure to go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number one, you're finally awake. The Elder Scrolls V, Skyrim. Hey, you, you're finally awake. As you open your eyes, you find yourself surrounded by prisoners while traveling on a cart. You're told by Rayloff that you were mistakenly captured during an Imperial ambush and are now being led to your execution. After creating your character, you're brought to the chopping block only to have your demise interrupted at the last second by Alduin. The mighty dragon then proceeds to destroy the village, allowing you to somehow escape. Being one of the most cinematic moments in this lengthy classic, it's absolutely no surprise that this is one of the most rewatched video game cutscenes of all time. In the mood for more awesome gaming content? Be sure to check out this video here on Mojo Plays. And don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.